Welcome to AES. Today we're introducing the ProTeam IX inverter heat pump. It's the latest heat pump from the ProTeam range. You'll be able to see here that it's got a lovely white case and a dark black fan cover which makes it a really nice contrast. The uh, fan hole here is where the expelled refrigerated air is pushed out of the unit in normal operation. On the side of the unit here is the LCD controller um, and it's housed inside a waterproof cover that uh, clamps down so that it keeps it dry in the weather. Then we've got the electrical compartment here which is removed so that you can terminate the live neutral and earth power supply into the heat pump and this keeps it all dry. At the bottom of the heat pump here we can see the drain plug. This is the drain plug that would be removed for winterisation uh, should you not be using the heat pump all year round and let's say you wanted to winterise, remove the water from the heat exchanger to prevent freezing, the drain plug allows you to do that. On the uh, side of the heat pump here what we can see is we've got the large evaporator coil on the back. This is where we extract energy out of the air and on the top left here we can see the pressure gauge which is the pressure of the refrigerant. Uh, because it's not connected at the moment, it's just showing the ambient air temperature because it's the ambient air that's pressurising the refrigerant at the moment. Then we can see that we've got an inlet and an outlet connector. Um, these come with uh, inch and a half glued sockets that um, allow you to um, glue directly into it with pressure pipe. And then we can do the union nut up onto the controller, so, uh, uh, sorry, on the side of the heat pump so that um, you can get a, a seal and there's a, a rubber gland inside. Um, the nice thing about these couplers is you can remove them completely because they've got a male thread going into the heat pump and it leaves a female inch and a half BSP thread. That's quite handy if you're going on to flexible hoses because we can just put a normal hose tail in there um, and you can go onto your push fit hoses with uh, Jubilees etc. Also included in the heat pump is the rubber anti-vibration mounting feet. There's four of those, one for each foot. Also is the instruction manual that you can see there. And a condensate tube. Now this has an elbow that pushes underneath the heat pump and then the condensate hose goes onto it to allow the condensate to run off to the side somewhere. Hope you like the video. If you'd like to ask any questions, please give our office a call and our sales team would be happy to help.